because feedback is a dialogue, not a monologue. So you don't want to just drop some, you know, you're terrible at this and leave, <laughs> right? That would yeah, be a yeah. career limiting move. Um, yeah. So you really want to think it through, including an exit statement. And I mm. practice it. I practice it. If it's important when I'm working with my clients and say I have to give difficult feedback to my clients, um, I would prepare and practice it because you think you have it in your head. But then once you start to talk, you realize, oh, I didn't have that. Mm -hmm. I didn't have that quite. I thought I, in my head is different from speaking it. So I yeah. think really trying it out. What are some good exit statements? Because uh, I can imagine our listeners are like, oh, that's such a great idea. What, what might I say? Yeah, I think anything that brings me um, on the same side as the person. So here's one. I'd say something like, you know, my intent was really to be helpful. Um, we're, we're on the same side here. And I think we both have the same interest to have the team be successful. I want us all to show up the best we possibly can. And that was the intent coming in here. I apologize if I offended you in any way, because that certainly wasn't my intent. 